What's up guys? It's Sydney and this is your 50 minute strength and conditioning workout. So grab your dumbbells and let's get started. Welcome to your 50 minute strength and conditioning workout. I'm so excited that you're here today. So excited to crush this workout with you. Start the week off on the right foot. Before we get started, make sure you have subscribed to the channel, especially if you're using these workouts a couple times a week or every day. All you have to do is just click right below this video and I appreciate it so, so much, okay? As far as dumbbells, let's go ahead and get you set up. I'm gonna move anywhere from my 10 up to my 30 pound dumbbells. We do have snatches at the end of the workout so you will be able to press up into your heaviest set of dumbbells. So medium to heavy dumbbells for today. We've got a lot of power moves, a lot of compound moves, upper body, lower body, and then combos of the two mixed in or superseted with some cardio or conditioning, okay? Also make sure you have your water bottle and your sweat towel out around you, and let's go ahead and get started, okay? Big thumbs up if you are ready. All right, here you go. Hands on your hips, turn your toes out just a little bit. We're gonna sit down plie squat in three, two, one. Here we go. Hips go back and down and stand. Press your feet into the floor, sit, stand. Good job. Practice coming back up to a neutral core. So not up here, just right here neutral. Good, now engage your glutes at the top. Good, two more. Last one. Perfect, hinge forward right down to the floor. Turn your hand up to the sky and down and switch. Good job, so we'll get a little hamstring stretch here as well as core. Rotating around your spine. Good job, three, two, one, and walk it out to a plank position. Drop your hips down and then go ahead and press up into down dog, okay? Keep rotating through that, down, tuck and lift, down, good, tuck and lift, almost there, one more, down, tuck and lift, and walk it back to your toes, great job. Roll up slowly when you get there, and let's go hamstring, high kicks. There you go. I'm trying to move you in all different ranges of motion today. Combining moves, supersetting them with cardio, so make sure right now we start breathing. There you go. One more each leg. Good, come back to the middle. Big cross in your arms. Perfect. Your head over to the right side. And over to the left. And up to the sky. And down in front. Good, take your hands right beside your thighs. Go back and straight up. Okay, so you're stretching out your lats here a little bit. Good job. A lot of these power moves will involve your shoulders, your upper body. So it helps to get all the different parts of your upper body ready and warm. Here you go. Two, one. All right, right leg out front, left leg back. Let's go down into a lunge. Okay, good space in between your feet. Pushing into the front foot and the back foot equally so you come up right in the middle of your two feet. Three. Two, and one, step up and switch. Okay, get your balance, and then go ahead and sink down right between your two feet. There you go, four, three, two, and one, good. Come back into the middle. How you feeling so far, good? All right, let's go ahead and jump into your first move. I'm gonna start with my 15s. If you remember last week, we did a lunge, single arm press. We're gonna add another dumbbell to that, okay? So forward or reverse, you're gonna go lunge, press, okay? Low impact, you take it lunge, stand, shoulder press. 
all right? You can go forwards or backwards. So if you wanna go forwards, you're here, okay? I'm gonna go reverse. So let's go in five, three, two, one. Here we go, 40 seconds. I want you to stand right back up on top of that front foot. Big push. Good, and you'll see a lot of me telling you to control the tempo today. Okay, so control, power. Good, 15 more seconds. Nice job, seven, four, three, two, one, rest. You've got 20 seconds rest, and we're going high knees forward, side shuffle backwards, okay? Or lateral agility, I should say. So, high impact option is here, on and off on the way back, okay? If you wanna go low impact, you give me a march. Here, here, step, step. Ready? Let's go. Forwards and back. Good. So way up with your knees in the front on the way down, quick and low on the way back. 40 seconds here as well. Good job. 10 more seconds, come on. You're doing great. Two, one, and breathe. Good job. Two more rounds of that. All right, let's go up again. No, I'm sorry, one more round of that. This is the last round, sorry. Two rounds of every superset. All right, let's go up if you can in five. Three, two, one, here we go. Lunge, push. Good, think of your hips, they go behind your heel. You're pushing to get them right back up on top of your heel. Good, exhale when you push. Good, 10 more seconds, come on. Four, two, one, great job. Same thing with your cardio on the way back or second round. Go high knees down, lateral agility on the way back. Big deep breath, here we go. Five, and take it low impact if you need to. Three, two, one, let's go. Good transition, so get there, drop and go. Breathe throughout, make sure you're not holding your breath, holding your arms right here. Good, 15 seconds. Go, go, go. Eight, seven, Three, two, one, and beautiful. Great job, grab some water, and we've got to rest here before our next circuit. So that'll be the format of your whole workout today, okay? 40 seconds of work, 20 in between, meaning you've got plenty of rest to switch out dumbbells if you need to. Also meaning you've got good rest so that you can make sure you're really pushing yourself on these power moves, okay? So, second circuit is double arm clean and press, a slow clean, boom, power press, okay? Second part is knee drivers. You're going forward, one, two, three, switch, okay? Low impact, just keep that foot on the floor, drive for three and switch, okay? So, double arm clean and press. I'm gonna go with my 20s. I'm gonna go slow on the clean, Power catch, power press. Okay, one more time. Slow on the clean, bring your hips forward. Power catch, 
power press. Okay, let's go in 10 seconds. We've got two rounds of each, remember? I'm gonna start with my 25s. Okay, here we go. Four, three, two, one. Hinge back, power clean. Catch, press, back down. Good, nice strong wrist. Beautiful. 40 seconds here. Beautiful. 10. Two, one, rest. Good job. And we've got three knee drives left, three right. You're gonna stay facing forward. Okay, so arms are extended here. You bring it up through your arms. One, two, three, okay? Three, two, one, let's go. Three, and switch. Good, now give me your intensity. Arms keep going right back up. And they pull down to meet your knee. Keep your core tight. Good job, 15. There you go. Keep rocking for eight, seven. Three, two, one, and rest. Clean and press again, round number two. Can you go heavier? If yes, let's do it. Scratch myself a little bit there. All right, here we go. Six, three, two, one, hinge back, let's go. Good job. Right before you press, tighten your core again. Good, let's go, let's go. Almost there, 15. Five, one more. Rest, good job. Whew. Okay, I'll just throw those down there as well. One more round, three knee drives and switch, all right? Scratch myself accidentally on that one. I'm okay, no worries. Four, three, two, one. Knee to the front, three, two, one, switch. And on number three, I just put it right down here. It becomes my front foot. Good. Think of grabbing something up top, pulling it down to meet your knee. Good, full extension, use your core as well. 11, 10. Come on, four, three, two, one, breathe. Good work. Circuit number two, done. Grab some water, you're doing great. We're moving on to Sorry, I had to get a drink. You've got a push press, single arm push press, okay? Slow on the way down, fast on the way up. I know we just did a press move, but this one is more only upper body, okay? So single arm, you're gonna stack this dumbbell right in your palm, it's sitting here, okay? Other arm straight out to the side, core tight. You've got a little dip, press, lock it out, slow, on the way back down. If you can, before it hits the locked in portion here at the bottom, on your way down, dip, punch. Okay, that's how you step it up. Right before you hit the bottom, go again. Okay, let's start together in three, two, one. Here we go. Slow, dip, punch. Slow, 
Good. Pull your core in on the way down so it doesn't come here, it stays here. There we go, slow dip punch. So it never really sits at the bottom. Good job, 10 more seconds. Slow, slow, slow. Good, ready to load again. Two, one, good, rest. All right, we've got lateral high knees, two squat pulses on the side. Okay, last week we did this and we just turned out, went squat. This week we're gonna go lateral high knees, one, two. Lateral high knees, one, two. Okay, let's go in three, two, one, here we go. Sit, one, two, low impact. March, 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 sit, one, two. Good, now just keep moving. You've got upper body on the power move, so giving you a little legs on the conditioning. Good job, 10. Four, three, two, one. Great job, we go over to the right arm now. Okay, power move again. On the way down, you go slow. You brace for that press. Okay, so we're here. Three, two, right when you get here, dip again. Okay, ready? Two, one, let's go. Three, two, dip one. Lock it out up top. And that dumbbell just needs to come straight down. So make sure it's not coming out here. Good. Nice strong forearm, strong wrist. Five, four, two, one, and rest. Good job. All right, lateral. High knees, and make sure you don't cross your feet over on this one. They stay apart, then you turn, sit, sit. Okay, here we go. Seven, four, three, two, lateral, let's go. Sit, one, two, up and back. Good job, let's go, keep it up. You're doing amazing. I need you to keep pushing. Last 20 seconds right here. Then we take a breather. Seven. Four. One more set. Three, two, one, and rest. Good job. Grab some water. Good work. I'm gonna throw some dumbbells back. You've got a minute rest in between each circuit. All right, breathe. Nice work, guys. So, keep breathing. Your next circuit, we have Romanian deadlifts. Slow on the way down, power, not fast, but power on the way back up. So I'm holding my dumbbells here in my hands. We're going three, two, one, Pause, look at my hips. Okay, notice you did not see me yanking on my upper body. Upper body stays solid, it's all on the hips. Back, power, back to meet your dumbbells. It's all right here, not right here. Okay, so let's go together. Eight seconds, three seconds on the way down. Pause, power, hips forward. Three, two, one. Control, pause. Okay, get that power. It's not about the upper body. Your upper body just has to stay strong while your lower body is stretching, engaging, powering back to the front. Good. 
Do not lift your upper body. Squeeze your glutes first. Five, four, two, one, rest. Now you've got a glute bridge hold with a dumbbell on top. Okay, dumbbell on your hips. Okay, throw it right on top, and I like to throw it kind of upper thigh. Okay, you're gonna hold that dumbbell there for 40 seconds. Right here. Three, two, one, go out, out. Now, don't worry about hip height. Worry about butt squeeze. Good, any metaphor that you want here. <laughs> Hungry, hungry hippos, you just went one round of hungry, hungry hippos. You just grabbed it and now you're holding on to it. Okay, squeeze the walnut, crack the walnut, hold on to a lot of money on a windy day, whatever it is. Keep the glutes together with power. 10 more seconds. Good, five. Two, one, beautiful. Now, can you go up on those Romanian deadlifts? It's all about the power here. So if yes, let's grab it. Okay, make sure your upper body can control it too. Okay, here we go. Five, four, two, one. On the way down, slow. Brace your core, squeeze the glutes, go. Good, strong back. Shoulder blades are pulled back, they do not relax. Ribs are tucked in. Good, hold on, you're right there. 13. Good, come on. Five. And rest. Beautiful. One of those dumbbells stays with you on your glute bridge hold. Great job, guys. Keep the heels down. Okay, make sure all the weight's not in your toes. Here we go. Four, three, two, let's go. Little tiny openings. Don't release the cheeks. You're not going for high belly button. You're going for tucked belly button, squeezed glutes underneath. Good, hold on to that money right between the glutes. Crack a walnut, turn coal into diamonds. Whatever metaphor you wanna use, don't let the cheeks go. They're not working on height, they're working on strength together. Stay here, six, five, three, two, one, and relax, beautiful job. All right, you're back to the rest. One minute rest. I'm giving you this good rest because I need you to stay fueled and rested and able to breathe between these power circuits, okay? It's not just get through it kind of workout. It's maximize your working time, then breathe. Maximize your working time, then grab water, okay? Working time is all in. The rest is intended to be rest so we can make it through with power, okay? So grab some water, 30 more seconds, and we're gonna go for a back squat tempo and then a core kind of combo. Okay, so imagine dumbbell is here on my back, or you can hold it here if you're not comfortable with the back squat position. One, two, pause, one, two, power up. So two, two, one. Okay, that's just a tempo talk. Slow on the way down, pause at the bottom, power up. That's another good way to put it, okay? So grab the dumbbell you would like to use at your chest, at your back. We go slow on the way down and fast on the way up, pausing at the bottom. In five, four, two, one, let's go. One, two, pause, one, two, up. Good. Right before you take off, squeeze your core, squeeze your glutes. There you go. A 
Good, don't round your back on the pause. Almost there. Eight, seven, one more. Four, three, two, one, rest. Good, dumbbell down. Come on down to your back. We've got a core combo here, okay? One, two, and three. One sit up, okay, two jackknives. One and two, and then three Russian twists. Okay, three per side. Ready? Let's start together. Two, one. You go one sit up, down, two jackknives, down, sit up, three Russian twists. Keep rocking. Good, keep moving. 10 more seconds. Four, three, two, one. Great job. All right, back squat tempo again. Can you go any heavier? If you feel great right there, stay right there, but challenge yourself, okay? The toughest part of this whole movement. Okay, let's go in two, one, here we go. Down one, two, pause, one, two, fire. Let's go. Keep your knees out, so don't get to the bottom. Hold and then go here. Okay, keep them out over your toes. One, two, press your heels and all your toes into the floor, up. Nice neutral hips, neutral knees. Four, three, two, one, rest. Good job. All right. Back to the core. One sit up, two jackknives, three Russian twists. You're doing great. Stay with me on this combo, just keep moving. Ready? Four, three, two, one. Let's go. One sit up. Two jackknives. Three Russian twists. Good work. Keep it up. Fifteen seconds. Come on. Don't slow down here. Four, three, two, one, and rest. Beautiful. All right, grab some water. You got one minute rest here. Big deep breath. Okay, so we move on again. Next move is one that you guys always get excited about, alternating snatches from the floor. Okay, we have two rounds, remember, right? We're going here, hinging back is the first move. Okay, core is tight, back is flat. Power heels into the floor, come up with the hips coming forward, and catch at the top. Okay, full speed. Looks like this. Okay, hips go back first, watch. Back, power, catch up top. Hips go here to bring that power in. Come down, come down. One more time. Okay, notice I'm all locked out from ankle, knees, hips, shoulders, elbows, wrists. Everything is locked at the top. We've got two rounds here. So, adjust your weights accordingly. We're alternating as well, so. Know for sure you're getting a weight that challenges you, okay? We'll go in 10 more seconds, all right? I'm gonna start with challenging weight for me, 50. I wanna get better at it, okay? Go with a weight that challenges you. Four, three, two, one, let's go. Oh. 
There you go, come on, power hips. Hips reach back. Get it locked out at the top too. Remember, don't let it go here or here. Straight up your body. 10. Five, four. Two, one, rest, good job. Now, I think I'm screaming, sorry. We go seated, twist, crunch, open and over. Okay, so you're back on the floor, giving your arms and your legs a little rest. Okay, you're going here, here, open, over, open, over, okay? Let's go in two, one, here we go. If you are baby on board right now, I want you to just go on your side, here, open, here, okay? Go to where, most importantly, it feels good for you. Good, keep those hips rolled back. Ten. Four, three, two, one, rest. Great job. And we're back, alternating snatches. Bump up if you can, no matter where you're at. A weight that challenges you. We go straight up your body. Don't let it come out here like a kettlebell. Don't let it come out to the side like a shoulder press. Right up your body. Two, one, let's go. Good, lock it at the top, don't forget. Don't just get it up here and then think, let me get it down. Lock it, okay? 20 seconds. Five, or 15. 10, five, one more, three, two, and rest. Great job. Back to the core. All right, have a seat. Heels stay down. Okay, you're opening, pulling back here. Ribs stay tucked, belly button stays rolled back. Three, two, one, let's go. Good, pull your ribs in, turn. Good job, 20 seconds. Almost there, come on. Seven, six, three, two, one, and rest. Whew. You've got one minute rest. This mat is disgusting. Whew. Grab some water. I'm sure you guys can relate. Whew. All right. On to our next move. We've got one that we did last time as a ladder. We're just gonna superset this time. Renegade rows, okay? So within the renegade row, sort of a ladder, but sort of not at the same time. You are resting in this, okay? So I'm gonna take my 15s, all right? Renegade row is a row, a row, and a push-up, okay? So we're gonna do a ladder every push-up you start over, okay? So we're doing one row, push up. We go one and two, push up, okay? One, two, three, push up. So kind of a ladder in itself, but after that you rest, okay? So let's go together in two or 10 seconds. I'm using my 15s. We go one, push up, one, two, push up, one, two, three, as high as you can in that 40 seconds, okay? Let's go in two, one, here we go. Pull to your side, push up. If you need to drop to your knees on the push up, that's okay. And then come back up for me. 
Also okay if you need to go off the dumbbells for the push-up. Okay, make it your own. Good job. Four, three, two, one, good. Now lay it back on your back. We've got reverse crunches, okay? Also sort of a ladder here. You're gonna go up for one, up for two, okay? Up for three, so you've got a single leg drive getting higher each time. All right, let's start with the left leg for one. Here we go, crunch, one. Right leg for two. Left leg for three. And then keep rocking at your pace. Don't yank your neck. Lift your shoulder blades. Keep it up. 10 seconds. Three, two, one, yes. Beautiful. <sighs> All right, we're back. We've got three rounds of this ladder, okay? Just to warn you, three rounds here. So this is round number two. All right, let's go in five, four. Start back at the bottom with one push-up, okay? Ready, here we go. Up and go two. Good, keep climbing, come on. This is you challenging yourself. I'm doing the same thing with myself. We're pushing ourselves, we're gonna finish together. But we can't do it unless we push hard right here. Eight, seven. Three, two, one, rest. Whew. Beautiful. Come on back down. Reverse crunch ladder. All right, so one leg for one. Other leg for two. Keep climbing. Don't yank your neck. So it's not here, it's here. Ready? Let's go. And to help you not yank on your neck, Touch your fingertips to your ears, okay? Just make sure you're not pulling on it. Come on, exhale. That's it, 10 more seconds. Don't stop when it burns, stop when we're done. Three. Rest, <sighs> beautiful. And one more time through those two, okay? We're very close to the end, guys. Super close. <sighs> All right. Here we go, if you wanna bump weights up, let's do it. If you wanna try some push-ups on your toes, definitely do it. Two, one, let's go. Last 40 of Renegade Rows. Pull the ribs in. Thirteen. Come on, five, four, two, one, rest. <sighs> Last round of your crunch ladder. <sighs> Sounds a little bit like crunch wrap, right? From Taco Bell? Any other Taco Bell fans out there? Not the appropriate time, I know. <laughs> We're almost here, come on. Five, four, three, two, come on. One, put it down, and two. Come on, let's go, we got this. It'll burn, we can do it. You'll get tired, you can do it. You'll wanna stop 
You can do it. Exhale every time your shoulder blades come off the floor. Seven. Come on, come on. We're right there. Ribs down. Two, one. And breathe. Hook onto your thigh. Roll it up. Grab some water. You've got a minute rest, and we've got one last little ladder circuit. Okay, the last one's gonna be kind of combining a lot of things that we did today. Squat, clean, and press. Okay, after that we have standing abs. Okay, so you're gonna go standing one, one, two. Okay, let me grab some water. I'll show you. Okay. Whew. We'll go in 20 seconds here. Squat, clean, and press. Okay, it's going to be right in the middle here. Okay, so we're gonna go sumo squat stance. Squat, clean, press. Okay, so squat, pull it up, catch, press. And if you need a little bump on the press, go right here. Okay, after that, standing ab ladder. So you go one crunch, one, two crunch, or you can bring it up here. Either way, you're going knee to elbow. Okay, so one, one, two, one, two, three, for the whole 40, okay? So, let's go with a squat, clean, and press. I'm gonna start with my 20s in three, two, one, let's go. Good job, squat deep. Power out of those legs so you can just float those dumbbells up. Press. Good job, almost there. Five, four, one more, two, one, and rest. Whew. Okay, I'm just gonna keep this dumbbell collection up here. So knee to elbow, whether you wanna stay down here or drive here. I'm gonna stand up and drive, okay? Seven seconds, we go one, one, two, one, two, three, okay? Ready, let's go. Keep climbing as high as you can in this 40. Exhale every time. Good, 15. Seven, six. Two, one. Great job. Squat, clean, and press. Round two, same thing as last time. We have three rounds, that's it. We're done after three, okay? So give me a weight that challenges you. I'm gonna go with my 20s. Okay, I'm going up five pounds. Go to where you feel in control, okay? Two, one, let's go. Deep squat, catch, and press. Good, back is flat the whole time, so make sure you're not hinging, you're sitting. Hips come up to the middle. Come on. Four, two, one, rest. Good. Whew. All right, standing abs. Now we're gonna add a twist. So I do want you to stay up top with me. Okay, we go twist, one. Twist for two. Okay, so you're twisting over top that knee. All right, keep the ladder style. Two, one, let's go. Keep it tall, you're twisting, not coming down.
Good, open chest, tall rotation. Eight seconds, good job. Two, one, 20 seconds rest. What do you have left? Right here, think about that and then go a little bit more intense, okay? Your mind will tell you stay here, it's safe. Your body is capable of a lot, okay? Give me all you've got for the last set of these guys. Three, two, one, come on, let's go. Big squat, power, push. Last half, come on. Leave it all out here, let's go. 10. Five, four. And rest. Whew. Okay, last round. Keep twisting. No ladder. One, two, three, four, okay? Single reps as high as you can in three, two, one. This is it, come on. Good, keep it up. Keep your hands up, ribs open, twist it all. Come on, last half, let's go. Elbows go big turns. 10, nine, come on. Six, five, three, two, one, and breathe. Whew. All right, grab some water. I want you to lay it down on your back for one minute of core, solid hold, okay? This is our last minute of workout, Pinky Promise. Okay, after this, we are literally stretching. You've made it to your cool down. So, options here, one minute hold. It can be here, I'll go from beginner to kind of more advanced option. Here, staying up, here, staying up, here, staying up, here, okay? Go to where you can rock it in four, three, two, one, let's go. Now, every 20 seconds, I'm gonna ask you to evaluate. Can you step it up a little bit more? Okay. Good job, roll your hips back towards the floor. Beautiful job. 20 seconds in, can you open up a little bit more? Maybe that's taking your hands from here to here. Good job. Last 20 in four, three, two, step it up if you can, let's go. Good, 10 more seconds, come on. Five, four, come on. Oh. Guys, you've made it to your cool down. That is it. Come on up to the front. Legs are straight out. Reach out for your toes. Great job. You made it to your cool down. We did it together. Exhale. Go down as low as you can. Don't forget before you head out to subscribe to the channel so we can keep growing. We're on the road to a million subscribers. And we can do it together, I know we can. I know if you have a friend who's looking for some kind of fitness to get into, tell them I program these workouts so you can follow along every day with me. You don't have to search through the channel. You don't have to pick, uh, go through and sort and say like, what am I feeling, what am I not? I program it, tuck your right leg in, left leg out straight. I program these workouts so that I, as your trainer, show up in your home, wherever you're training, 
just as I would if I were going to your house every single day to train you, okay? I'm gonna train you in a way that helps you become more coordinated, stronger, okay? Helps you believe in your own strength a little bit more too. Go ahead and switch. Sometimes we need that. A lot of times we need that. <laughs> so it's not that you have to go through and pick. It's not a random upload. It's not an upload to where I'm just hoping everyone does this one workout a million times. I want you to follow me every single day and I'll lead you as a personal trainer would to get you to your goals, okay? Because I am your personal trainer, or at least I feel that way, <laughs> okay? Come on over to your hands and knees. Give me that left leg up top and push your hips down forward. Great job today. So if you have anyone that you can think of that maybe just needs a kickstart, we have low impact workouts. Those are a great place to start. Okay, we have body weight workouts. If you know someone that doesn't have any equipment right now, another great place to start. And we have the daily uploads where you can follow along every day and you don't have to worry about are you picking the right thing for your programming. Okay, switch legs. I've taken all that guesswork out for you. I'm doing all the work where you just show up and I'm training you. And that's it, totally free. Because everyone deserves this access to fitness. Everyone deserves a trainer who will show up consistently and give them a program that's catered to results. Exhale, lift your hips up in the sky, both feet are down, drive your heels down. Walk back to your toes. Stay here for a second. And just remember, this week is gonna be different. I can feel it. This week is going to be a big week for us. Okay, slowly roll up to the top. Cross your arms over your chest. Okay, this is gonna be a big week for us. It's gonna be that week where things just start to click for us. We put in some work here today, without a doubt. You gotta get things in order on your nutrition end. Keep the water bottles around you. Make sure you do things that keep you happy. Okay, flood your life with good music. <laughs> Pay attention to what you're letting into your ecosystem and what you just say, you know what, this isn't serving me anymore. Okay, bless and release the things that aren't helping you become a better version of yourself. Good, go ahead and switch legs. It's all about what helps you become better. If people around you aren't helping that come true, go to the people that are. Okay, come back here each day. You will become better. Better at trusting yourself, better at becoming your own best version of yourself and your strength here, your strength outside of the workout. Okay, so it doesn't have to be anything where you change your whole entire life in one day, but what are you deciding to consistently do and not negotiate on when you're not in the mood? This week is gonna be different. I can feel it. I can just feel us changing our lives one decision at a time, okay? So make sure, keeping the things around you that support you, that lift you up in that better version of yourself. The things that don't, bless and release. Pull more of the positive in. Don't worry about, I have to cut this out. I have to cut this out. Don't think, think about the negative. Focus on what you're pulling in that's positive, and that will start to become your life, okay? It doesn't have to be an elimination of everything that you think is maybe not good, or maybe is too sweet for your diet, or maybe it's too many carbs. Don't think about eliminating things. Think about pulling in more of the positive, positive music, positive people, positive environments at home, things that support your goals. Okay, lots of fresh veggies, lots of fruits, lean protein, whole grains, more of those good things and those will start to fill up your life and they'll become who you are. Okay, so pull in the positive. This week is going to be different for us. I can just feel it. So make sure you help me do that by growing this channel so our community all over the world can get this message. We're stronger together, okay? We're going for results, we're going for goals, and we're going for our best versions of ourselves. Okay, so make sure before you head out, I wanna see that you did this workout. Make sure you give it a thumbs up, even if you come here every day. This is your check-in. Yes, personal trainer, I did my workout, and then subscribe to the channel so I know our community can get access to these workouts every day, and I will see you back here tomorrow. I love you guys, bye.